Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm here with my June favorites. It is mind boggling to me that we have already gone through five months of 2016. Like, where did the time go? Like, it's, I know it sounds so cliche, it really does, but it's like, I was just sitting down to film this and I'm like, how the heck is it June already? It's, it's blowing my mind. But I have a ton of stuff for you guys today. A lot of stuff is brand new that I've never shown before on my channel, so I'm super excited. I also got some new items just the other day that I've already fallen in love with, so I'm gonna show you those too. So let's jump right in. So my first favorite of the month has definitely been this Benefit Cheekathon palette. Now if you guys are blush lovers as much as I am, you definitely need to pick this up. This is a $110 value, I believe, for only $58. And inside you get five full-size blushes and bronzers that are just so gorgeous. I mean, look how big those are. They're all full-size and they're such pretty colors. In here you get Dandelion, Hula, Rockator, Coralista, and Dallas. And in this little bottom section you also get the little brush which is floating around here somewhere. But let's be real, no one ever keeps track of those things. But I just think it's such a great value. Value. and all these blushes are ones that I would buy anyway so I saved a ton of money by buying this and I really think you guys would love it as well. I'm seriously the biggest fat kid ever. I talk about cake and cupcakes in every single video and so why not feature this cake flavored perfume in my video? This is the Fresh Cream by Philosophy Perfume. I found this I think it was a couple months ago when I was at Sephora in San Francisco with my husband and the girl recommended this to us because I told her I wanted something that smelled really sweet and this you guys, it smells like Funfetti cupcakes with sprinkles on it. It makes me smell so amazing, like I smell like a cupcake. And if you don't wanna smell like a cupcake, then we can't be friends because I'm all about that cupcake life. Like I wanna bathe in this. Like I seriously spray so much of it on me, it's insane. Like the fact that I've only gone through this much, I don't even know how that's possible because I swear I pump half a bottle onto myself every single day. So definitely pick this up if you can. So I saw Amanda Ensing here on YouTube talking about these a while back and I absolutely had to go pick them up. These are the Makeup Revolution Matte Blushes in the colors Nude and Fusion. Now these are the best drugstore blushes I have ever tried. I picked these up at my local Ulta. Now Nude is probably my new favorite blush color of life. Like it's so pretty. Look how gorgeous that is. That's Nude right there. And then Fusion I don't love quite as much but I still really love it. This one definitely has more of a pink undertone to it but still really, really pretty. Like look at that, that's Fusion and that's Nude. Now I think these were only like seven or eight dollars each and if you use like one of those 350 off of 10 coupons at Ulta, they're even cheaper. So definitely run out and pick these up if you have the chance. I promise you will not be disappointed. So I'm not sure if I've talked about this on my channel before, but because I am so fair skinned, I tend to get a lot of red splotchiness on my face, especially like right in this area and on my chin. So I've never been able to find anything that I love the way it works, but when I found this, I was so super duper excited. I found it at Sephora, I tried it out and I bought one and I am loving it. Like I wanna go back and get all the other colors. They make a purple one and a yellow one I believe as well. And I think they make a concealer possibly too. Um, but this one is obviously the green one for all my redness. I put this all along my nose, in my chin, any areas where I have redness and it's seriously gone, like it never existed. Um, and the shade of green is just perfect. The blendability of this is unlike anything I've ever tried in my life. It is a little pricey. I wanna say this is 28 or $30, so definitely not a drugstore item, very, very high end. Definitely a little expensive, but if you can afford it, this is seriously one of the items I'd recommend you most picking up, especially if you have a lot of red splotchiness or uneven skin tone. So you guys know I love skincare. I talk about it a lot here on my channel, and this month I've been absolutely obsessed with this. This is the Rodan and Fields Lip Renewing Serum. Now for some reason when I got this, I just assumed it would be like a whole tub of the product, but what it actually is, is 60 of these little silver pods, and what you do is you rip off the tip of it and then squeeze it onto your finger and apply it to your lips. Now, it says you can only get one use out of each pod, but I really get two or three, if not more, because there is a ton of product in these pods. This, I believe, was about 50 or $55, and you get 60 capsules in here. Also from the Rodan and Fields line is the Microdermabrasion Paste. You guys, I've had such problems with my skin lately and ever since I started using this, it has made the hugest difference in my skin. It smells so good, number one. Like it smells like, like oranges I wanna say, yeah. Like probably like oranges. Um, and it has a really nice grit to it so it gives you a really nice deep exfoliation without being overpowering. Um, when you rub it into your skin, it just, it feels so nice, like it's, it exfoliates, but it also softens and it makes your skin feel moisturized at the same time. And like I said, I've been using this a couple times a week for several weeks now, and I've seen such a drastic improvement in my skin. I highly recommend this. Um, you can get this from rodanandfields.com from the representative. I will leave her link down below if you're interested. And I believe this was about $75. I feel like, I feel like a lot of people assume that when you make YouTube videos that you put on makeup every single day. And for me, that's definitely not the case. I only wear makeup when I'm filming or if I'm going to a special event or a party or something like that. Now lately I've been trying to be better about that because I've noticed that when I do wear makeup, I feel a lot more confident, I feel more pretty, I feel more like girly or whatever. 
but I don't want to spend hours putting on my makeup every day. It's just not realistic for me. But lately I've been using this, which is the Tarte Tinted BB Primer. I use this as actually like my foundation and my primer all in one. I squirt a little bit into like the tips of my hands. I rub my fingers together just to kind of warm it up and then I apply it all over my face and it really just melts into my skin. It looks so natural. It goes on so fast, like I'm able to apply an entire face of foundation and primer in like 10 seconds. And there's no like blending it out with the beauty blender, like your hands do the perfect job with this. And then I just set it with a little bit of translucent setting powder. And I believe this is one ounce or two ounce. This is one ounce, um, but this seriously will last me months at a time. And I just set it with a little bit of my Laura Mercier setting powder and I am good to go like out the door. So this next favorite is kind of random, but I'm absolutely obsessed with it and I had to show you guys. It's a t-shirt from ASOS that just says brains, beauty, and booty. It's really soft, it's really comfy, and I just love the words. I think they're so cute. I think they accurately describe my personality. Um, if you guys want to buy it, I'll leave the link down below. So I'm just now realizing how many blushes I have in this favorites video and it's kind of ridiculous, but this is the last one I promise. This is the Dandelion Dew Cream Blush by Benefit. I got this a month or two ago and I believe I actually featured it in another video recently, but it deserves multiple mentions, so it's okay. This color, you guys, I there's no words. I literally have no words to describe this color. It's just so pretty. Like, look how gorgeous that is. It's blendable, it's buildable, and it looks so nice on the skin. Like, it looks so natural. It doesn't look overpowering at all. And I just, I can't say enough good things about it. So one of the last few items I have is this Anastasia Beverly Hills Brow Definer. I got this at IMAX this past year, and since then I've purchased about four or five more. So now I have like six of them, which is absolutely insane but I just think it's so nice. They come in such a wide range of colors. They're really blendable, they're really buildable. Um, and I just love the angle tip because it gives you a lot of versatility. You can make thick straight lines, um, you can make thin lines. They're perfect for making like your little brow hairs and stuff. I mean, I just, I can't say enough good things about these. So if you guys have been watching my channel for a while, then you know that my Holy Grail makeup remover wipes were the pink Maybelline ones that were discontinued. Now why they were discontinued, I don't know. It's mind boggling to me because they were amazing. So why would you discontinue something like that? But whatever. But I buy them online and they're kind of expensive, but I've been buying them online anyway because I cannot find anything that I love nearly as much. But recently I went to CVS and I found these and I love CeraVe. I swear by pretty much everything in their line. I was recommended their line by my dermatologist probably 10 years ago almost and I've been obsessed with them ever since. And so when I was at CVS the other day and I saw that they came out with these makeup remover wipes, I obviously had to try them, I mean, duh. So I got them, I got them home. You guys, these work even better than the pink Maybelline ones. Like I never thought I'd be able to say that in my life because those were so amazing, but these are even more amazing. Like I cannot even get over it. They don't have a strong smell at all. They don't burn my eyes, which a lot of makeup wipes do. They're really gentle on my skin, but they still take everything off without me having to sit there and like scrub my face with it. Like you honestly just need to like swipe and it comes off like a dream. Like it's amazing. And I think these were only three or $4 for a pack of 25, which is an amazing deal. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed seeing all of my favorite products for May. Definitely let me know in the comments down below what your favorite products were for this month. I'd love to check them out and I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye. Dandelion and I have that here as well. Now because this is a cream blush, when you're attacking it, you want to go a little bit heavier just because you are going to blend it out quite a bit, or at least I am.